Welcome back. We're talking about keywords you don't have to panic about. When Casey ran out of remedies for her chronic knee pain, she found one final option, but would it work? Two years ago, I had successful ACL surgery. A year ago, I started having uh, some knee pain, and the past few months, it's been excruciatingly painful to run and be active as I used to be, and I definitely don't want to undergo surgery again, so I was given the opportunity to have a non-surgical procedure, and I'm hoping this will work, and I'll be able to play the sports I love get back out there. Join us now are Dr. Ralph Venuto, an orthopedic surgeon, and his patient, Casey. Welcome to both of you. Thank you, Hi, guys. So, Dr. Venuto, Casey developed chronic tendonitis after the surgery? Yeah, what happens is when we do an anterior cruciate reconstruction, we take a piece of the patellar tendon, that's the tendon that goes to the kneecap to the leg. Okay. We take the center third of it, and at the point where it was taken, she developed a chronic inflammation. It's a complication, not a common one, but she got it. So how do you manage that kind of pain, and what do you do to handle, then, the tendonitis? Well, patellar tendonitis is common in athletes. It's called jumper's knee. It's real common in jumping sports like basketball, so we see right. it a lot. And usually it's handled by heat and ice and stretching and physical therapy, sometimes cortisone injections, but you don't like to do a lot of those because it hurts the tendon. So we tried all those things with Casey, and it just didn't work. We managed her pain by doing something called PRP. PRP. Yeah, it's also... The real term for it is hemocyte tissue matrix graft, but oh, PRP boy. is the term we use. And it's a P word show, so we have to say PRP. Yeah. It's PRP. Platelet-rich plasma therapy. Correct. Whenever you have an injured part of your body, the body sends platelets there. Platelets are cells in your blood. Platelets have healing factors in them. What we do is we take the patient's blood, and we spin it down in a special centrifuge, and we concentrate those platelets. And then we take that platelet concentrate and put it where the inflammation is. We inject it, actually. And that's what, then all those healing factors come to play. There's something in, in platelets called angiogenic factor. It means it brings blood supply to the area. So it does everything your body tried to do but couldn't accomplish because there wasn't a high concentration of those cells. And it heals it. That's basically what it is. It was developed first for tennis elbow, chronic tennis elbow. That's where it was first used up at Stanford. And it's being used for lots of things now, but it's best for chronic tendonitis of various parts of your body. Okay, so... Because the one thing we do need to clarify is people are using PRP therapy for anything and everything. The data is still very mixed on it. It, it seems to be working wonderfully for some people in some conditions, but it's not a cure-all. Yeah, I'm very glad to hear you say that because that's the last thing I want to get across here. This is specific. It has a success rate that's still somewhat mixed. How do you know, then, if you're a candidate for this? If you have tendonitis, do you just automatically inquire about this? Well, if you've had chronic tendonitis, you've had all the normal treatment that's not working, okay. and you're getting to the point where the doctor's thinking about doing surgery again to okay. treat it, that's when you go, wait a minute, maybe there's something else. I see. All right. The and the good news is it's, it's a relatively simple procedure. It's not a big operation. You're just injecting the patient's own platelets in that area. How did it work for you? Yeah, well, that's the magic question. It's great now. It's only been a week, so and I'm not supposed to be doing any activity just yet, so it feels great when I'm walking stairs and everything, but once I get active, I'll be able to tell. You'll be able to tell yeah, more. Yeah, because that's when it really hurt. So, Jillian, cro and... cross your fingers with me, because we're hoping for you <laughs> that you. this is the cure. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> excellent. Believe me. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you both so much.